It's time for KH Sports, presented by Glen St. Motors, celebrating 70 years in business. The countdown continues. We're nine days away from Pac Day. Saturday, April 20th, will be an Arkansas State party for football, baseball, track and field, and tennis. Butch Jones was on the Sun Belt Conference Zoom this morning. The Red Wolves have just three sessions left before the spring game. Position battles continue along with more depth being developed. The first A State scrimmage was on April 6th. I asked coach about the game plan for the next Red Wolves workout on Saturday. Obviously, you saw some controlled scrimmage things, some third down things, some red zones, some low red areas, but we'll continue to do the same this Saturday. So we'll have another scrimmage. And I think it's important that we don't have any coaches on the field. And so much of it is not just the execution of your systems, but also the fundamentals and details that go in with the operations of learning to take your signals, learning how you line up, all those things of playing fast. And then there was live special teams as well. So we'll continue that. And then next week we'll get back to our normal practice routine. And then obviously pack day in our spring game on the 20th. A-State women's bowling is in Michigan preparing for the NCAA championship. Four Red Wolves are 2024 All-Americans. Emma Stoll, Carly Van Dynen, Brooklyn Buchanan, and Faith Welch earned NTCA honors this evening. Stoll is averaging a 208 this season. She has three individual top 10 finishes. Van Dynen is rolling a 209 per game. She also has three individual top 10s. Buchanan earns All-American honors for the third straight season. She's averaging a 201. Welch also joins rare A-State company by becoming a three-time All-American. She's rolling a 202. The Red Wolves start NCAA championship play tomorrow morning at 8.